Let me ask you uh, a one billion dollar question. Um, if somewhere in Africa, a young girl, lady, is watching this program or is listening to you, what would you, what would be your advice to her? What does she need to do, for example, in order to stand on your shoulders mm -hmm. so as to see a little bit further than you? Yeah, I don't see any other way except empowering her through education. First and foremost is education. There is no shortcut. There is no shortcut other than you have to take uh, the school seriously. Mm -hmm. And uh, I know, I don't know, was it you who mentioned about these early pregnancies, which has weighed very heavily on our girls in our societies. But if you are not educated, you are not empowered. But also, hard work. You know, sometimes people, they say they are sexually abused because sometimes they, they, they want favors and these shortcuts. Mm -hmm. <laughs> hard work. Hard work is what will bring you to greater heights. From the school, from what you do if you are at work, you are writing your book, I know you spend a lot of time on it, <laughs> and it came out beautiful, you okay. see? So this is uh, the values I would want to impart to our children that don't want, don't go for shortcuts. Shortcuts are not sustainable. Very interesting. You know, there's a saying that uh, all of life <laughs> is action and passion. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. And to ignore the actions and passions of your time or your generation mm. is to risk having really not lived at all. Mm -hmm. well, what about you? Uh, time is not our best ally. Um, I agree with everything that the ambassador said. If there's a young girl, um, whether it's in anywhere in Africa, I mean, I think it's empowerment through education. And it is that there's no shortcuts. I mean, in the social media world, Shaka, one of the dangers is people think you can, you know, find a shortcut. One day you're no one and, some, and the next day you're everyone. Mm. <laughs> but it's hard work. It's hard work. And the ambassador referred to you know, to, to my book. I mean, mm. it took me more than a decade to write the book, and only after 20 years of working um, with Ellen Johnson Sirleaf and 30 years on the continent, mm. did I feel like I had the right to tell the story. <laughs> 30 yeah. seconds, okay. So, oh. Yeah, to remain focused. Yeah. Yeah, to, to your goal, to your goal. Unfortunately, and dreams. time <laughs> is not our best ally.